Alright, this is going to be for Aquarius mid-month. I've already put out all the cards. Oh, to see how I like this way. And I did. And the first part I have for you on the bottom of the deck was the Three of Cups. Okay. And I clarified it with the Miss Kipper deck, Aquarius. We're in the middle of October, and it looks like a marriage is going to happen, but someone's concerned. Your lover is concerned, Aquarius, about a marriage, whether you're going to marry them or not, or whether the marriage is, they're just concerned. They're concerned, you know, they're either concerned that you're not going to marry them, or the marriage is too soon. I'm getting both, so however it fits you, okay? Uh, in some cases, Aquarius, the person may not want to marry you. They may be a false person, okay? They may not want to marry you. Or they may be marrying you for sneaky reasons. Um, I got the high priestess here, the courthouse, the pathway, so they may be just wanting to take you to the courthouse and spend the minimum amount of money to marry you so they can get what they want, I guess. Um, Miss Cleo, could you clarify the mature man? On this knife cup that you put down. And actually, Aquarius, I see that you're not sure neither. Thank you. The Queen of Cups in reverse. Yeah, you're not sure neither. Um, you're not sure. They're not sure. It's probably best not to do it. If you're not sure and they're not sure, it's probably best not to do it. Hold off on it. You know, you can always get married at a later date. It's not a rush thing. Okay. We're seeing that you want children in the future. Okay. And there is a possibility that ch a children is on the horizon for you. So if you don't want children, use protection. And I have the Six of Cups here in the Privileged Lady and the Thief right behind it, okay? And then the Community. So, there may be someone in your direct community, like a neighbor across the street or a couple of houses down across the street, that's watching when you come and go from home. So they can come in and sneak around your property and possibly steal something, okay? Yeah, I'm seeing they're looking for money. Or looking for something to sell. <clears throat> okay, and for some of you others on here... Not only are, do you have that person over in your community, your neighborhood, that is looking for something to sell, steal to sell, but you also have a sneaky man here. You have a very sneaky man here. I'm going to say he's quiet. He's very, very, very quiet. He just like to sit there and he just smiles and he might say one or two words and then he smiles. He's listening to everything. He, uh, don't trust him. 
I'm going to say don't trust them. He seems to be a person that's supposed to have some emotion for you, but he has none. Okay? I don't see him having anything for you. He looks like to be out for himself. I do see a fatherly figure that is concerned for you over a marriage. Now, um, it may be the marriage that uh, you and your lover have doubts about. I kind of feel like both of you are kind of holding your doubts back because you really like one another, but you just are not ready to get married. And then there's some of you are that is ready to get married, okay? You just need to talk to your partner is what I'm saying. If you have concerns, you tell me you have concerns. If they have concerns, you know, talk to them. It's okay if you have concerns. We can put it off if you want to. Let's talk about it. This is what's going to make us a great couple. I am also seeing that if you don't talk about it, okay, if you don't talk about it with them, the closer it gets to the wedding, there's going to be a fight between you. They're going to pull up a fight, do something to fight with you so they don't have to marry you. Because they're just not ready. And this may actually kill the relationship altogether. You know? So go ahead and talk about it now. Oh, Kipper, do you have anything else for Aquarius for the middle of October? Last couple of nights I've been tossing and turning. I don't know what it is. Thank you. Wealthy man. Official person. Imprisonment. In the reverse. Well, I don't even think the Kipper has reverse. So. Um, will it be in the reverse? I'm going to say they don't want to be tied down. I'm going to say they do have some money, and they don't want to be tied down. They're worried about people being after them for their money. If you have an exp expensive bracelet, Aquarius, and the thief comes in your house, that's going to be one of the first things they take, it looks like. Uh-huh. That's what I see. I see several cards telling me the wrist, the expensive bracelet. It means a lot to you. It it may have more sentimental value to you than it does than it than it does value. I'm saying it has some value, but it may have more sentimental value than it does value. All right, blessings to you.
thanks for letting me read for you. Hit that subscribe button, the like, the share. And if you'd like a personal reading, everything is over in my about. Have a good one.